Hi, MTV Cribs. Um, come in, come in. All right, so this is my grandparents' house. Technically, my grandmother's house. Let's have a tour, shall we? Mirror. There's our camera person. <laughs> She's gorgeous. That's my mom. And if you look over here, sure, there's a... Uh, family photos. I'm up here chilling with Jesus and Mother Mary. I messed around with clay a lot when I was younger. Here's my attempt at a rose. I don't know how long that's been. I've <laughs> It's been years. I was single digits. Here, I'll even showcase my brothers that he made at the time. It's supposed to be a, a reference to Robot Chicken. And a lot of these that you'll see here are sculptures that were painted by my grandmother years ago. Orca. Once upon a time, I was really obsessed with like claymation movies and shows and one that I remember watching a lot was uh, Wallace and Gromit. I think it was like the Were Rabbit movie. <laughs> and so I looked at the behind the scenes stuff and they would show how to make these little clay figures. And I was like so obsessed with it. The body is just a blob of plasticine, basically. I've used some white plasticine to make some little teeth. And then I think we would add on his nose. So that was my attempt at it. And it Leave it to the professionals. There's a washing machine over here that's going off. Here's the oven. In case y'all forgot that butterflies are kind of my staple. Another one. And even more over here. And if we go down this hall, butterflies. Yeah, light switches are the bane of my existence. I want to show off this lovely room here. Yeah, it's just a dark closet. I want to hide in here. That's what I should have done when I was younger and went over here when we had company over that I didn't want to hang out with. I should have just hid here in the closet. <laughs> didn't really think of that one. Here's a bathroom where, in case you can't tell, I just showered. More butterflies there. They're everywhere. Little wind chime up there. This little brush. One time I was wearing lipstick when I was younger and I tried to wash it off with that and it's forever stained since then. Oh, it's getting too bright in here. I need my glasses back on. This is uh, the room I used to have to sleep in when my mom would be off at the hospital getting her gallbladder taken out. I have memories of this room. I would blow dry my hair over there and since I was, I'm pretty sure I was going through my emo phase at the time, so I also straightened my hair. Yeah, we have a little wind chimey situation over there. Hummingbirds. Not me getting nosy. That's a crystal. I don't know what kind, but that's a crystal. I'm taking it. Santa's getting this bag, y'all. That was the pink room. But this here, the blue room, where I'm stepping on the rug and messing it up. This is where my brother would have to stay when, you know, we'd be stuck here while my mom's off in the hospital. These, in that I believe, came from Germany. We love when things are imported. <laughs> I don't think that's the right way to use that in this context. My grandpa, when he was younger and in the military. Butterflies next to it, which not only am I just obsessed with butterflies in general, but anytime that I see one in a spiritual sense, it's usually connected to my grandpa in some way. And seeing that there just kind of, it doesn't seem like a coincidence anymore. We got Banjo Santa. It's a bop. Painted statues, uh, sculptures, things over here. I'm good at describing things. Oh yeah, I, I completely skimmed over this. Yeah, I looked like a ball of sunshine when I was a baby. And then this, now it's kind of just a room where we gather things. There's movies over there, more movies. We have Titanic over here. That's, that's a goodie. There's also Elvis because my grandma is obsessed with Elvis. That's kind of her thing. That and baby dolls kind of terrifying. Like, this place is ripe for creepy instances. That said, we're standing in a room right now that we think is haunted. The other day, my dad was here. He heard what sounded like footsteps coming from this room. And this was where my grandpa liked to chill a lot. It's cold in here, so maybe, maybe there is a ghost. I don't know. All right, well, come on, guys. Let's get out of here. I'm socially anxious, so if you could just, um, just <laughs> Let's go in the backyard. It looks a bit different out here these days. This is where me and my friends used to hang out quite a bit when it came to birthday parties anyway because my parents never let me have friends at my house. It's whatever. I'm totally over it. That looks like the same bench that has always been here though. I actually have a picture of me and my brother when we were younger where we were standing like right there. You're still here? This has been Chasing Comets. Hope you like what you saw. Kind of experimental compared to what I normally do. What can I do? I like watching the style of content. Do the birds have something to say? I think that might be a raven. I don't I don't know the difference. I don't know the difference between birds. I don't know if that's a raven or if that's a crow, but I take black birds as a good sign for me. <laughs> subscribe, hit that bell button next to the subscribe button so that way you can be notified every single time I upload a video. And that is it. Bye guys.